Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are having a great day. If you're new here, my name is Fabiola. I'm a makeup artist and content creator on Instagram, YouTube, and TikTok. And today I'm gonna show you all the product that I've enjoyed in the past three months. So all my favorites, but I'm really hyped. And obviously there's product that I'm still going to be using during the fall months. So I hope you guys are excited. Grab a snack or obviously. Anyway, if you want to know what were my top favorite skincare and makeup item for the summer months, then just keep on watching. So I figured let's start by skincare because it's actually, you know, it's actually the first step into our makeup routine. So I'm going to go with this one because that's the product I think I used almost every day uh, for the past, since I got it. So I got it in PR, but this is amazing. This is the Karen Jonka Elixir. It is the Youth Elixir. So in French, it's the Elixir de Jeunesse. Um, it is a five in one. It is a beauty mist. It smells amazing and I haven't met any beauty elixir or beauty mist that does something except this one. Um, this is so good. They also have a mini travel size. It's so cute and it's like I just I love this product so much that I want to bring it with me everywhere. Um, and I think if you go to Jean Coutu, if you're near my area or in the Quebec, Quebec area, if you go to Jean Coutu, it's often on sales. I think right now it's on sale for 20% off. What? So it's super affordable for the size that you get. And it's so good. Like, oh, so amazing. You can put it during the day on top of your makeup. That's my first item. And then to follow that, I'm going to go with the Karen Jonka eye patches because I'm already talking about Karen Jonka. But these are the best eye patches in the entire world and more. Um, they're super affordable as well. But oh, they're just super refreshing, but I feel like they just plump your under eyes. It makes your concealer like not crease. It's super hydrating. It's also a really great boost of like collagen. We call it the Dermal Lift Corrective Eye Patches. It's great for puffiness, dark circle. It's, it gives an instant smoothing effect. It's an express moisturizing therapy, intense eye contour care. It has phytocollagen concentrate, vitamin E, and witch hazels. To try any product from their line, it's, it has to be the immediate. But I mean, I'm trying now their um, youth cream and oh it's just so cooling so lightweight i really wanted something like more lightweight i'm gonna explain to you why in a few seconds but oh i don't know i feel like their their skincare line you cannot go wrong with any of their products even like the mask they sent me like the lifting mask oh i'm gonna do this tonight it's so good i mean that's that and then i'm trying to hurry up because we have a lot to tackle here um, the next product I think is going to be like a trio actually, because I feel like they work best. They work best together. Um, so this line, I've been using it for like nine months. I think it's the Lancome Absolute line. So you have the, uh, face cream and the eye cream. It's a little bit more on the pricier side, but it's so fucking good. And my skin has never been this perfect. Like, it's insane. I don't know what they do, but they know what they're doing. So I've been using this cream. It's a little rich right now. And I feel like, I don't know, the end. I really liked the Karen Jonka one because it's a lighter formula. So I'm going to really enjoy that during the summertime and like end of the summer right now. But when the colder months comes, I'm pretty sure I'm going to pick it up because I get like really, really dry skin. And then the best duo ever that I'm still going to use right now is the Lancome HCF Triple Serum. So it's a three serum, but as you can see, it has like three little holes. And so this is a serum and this is an eye cream, but both together. <gasps> insane. It's insane. I feel like I have already have less like little fine lines away. Like I feel like my skin around my eyes is super plump. And um... I don't know, I just, I've been really loving these. I got the serum as well, like the face serum in PR, and I've yet to try it, but I'm scared because I know I'm going to love it and I'm going to have to rebuy them because 
that's how good they are. And the last skincare product that I have to talk about, because it's been my favorite for a while now, and I think I mentioned it in my yearly favorite, but it is the Summer Friday Shade Drop Broad Spectrum SPF 30 Mineral Milk Sunscreen. Oh, it's so good. I'm not sure if it works on all skin tones. I think uh, my friend Beauty by Bowden on Instagram reviewed this sunscreen and it didn't work on her skin tone. It's mineral, doesn't have like all those little junk. This sunscreen is the best sunscreen ever and take it from a girl who always burns. And it doesn't leave a white cast because it's actually like a beige color. So you don't get the white cast. So that is all for the skincare part. Now for the fun part, which is makeup. Um, I think I'm gonna start with these because in the beginning, in the beginning of summer, that's the only blush that I was wearing, and I think you guys won't be surprised. But it's the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Cheek Tint. I mean, they're so good. They're just so good. And for fall, I think I'm gonna, you know, combine those two because. You can't even do this off or fall. I mean, you know, reflex. Um, you know how it goes. Um, but the formula is amazing. I also like using it on my eyes. I don't know if it's safe though, so don't take my words on this. But, oh, liquid blush. So it's not the same thing as like a cream blush. Um, it's more like a serum blush, if that makes sense. It was one of my favorite this summer and I was obsessed with it and that's the only thing I was wearing. It's so amazing. I think the pink shade was my favorite. Like, ugh, I used it so much and I really loved it on like on top of like a lip product because it just gives a little bit of like a glow but also like a pinkier undertone so so um that's that for the blush the liquid blush and then halfway through the summer by the end of the summer i got these in the mail and if you follow me on instagram you know but i got so obsessed by the formula then i actually uh, reached out to the brand to create this little collaboration but just so you know it's all because of these so these blush are amazing um, this is the pinkier shade and this one was the color I was so obsessed with. Um, so this is in the shade tipsy and this one is in the shade pink, I think. So it's just like a Barbie pink and this one is a, um, how can I describe it? Like burnish, I don't know how to describe it. But these were the two colors. I was obsessed with them. That's the only thing I was using. Um, our formula are amazing like you can do everything with this like your lips your cheeks your eyes It's so good and you get a cream and a powder I only was wearing these and that got us into creating those three palettes Which by now if you follow me you already know about them Which they're probably gonna be in my fall favorites because I'm wearing them right now I'm wearing the bronze cheeky mixed with the bronzer but and i added a little bit of the candy one so i'm actually wearing both like all three of them well stay tuned because in my next video i'm doing a tutorial using these and i'm gonna present to you all the little set we created and um yeah the collection is called the cafe collection because obviously if you use my code fabula15 you get 15 percent off on your entire order as well even those blush and the lip peptide that I'm going to present to you in my favorites. Okay. So stay tuned and subscribe because in my next video, I will show you how to use them. And the packaging is so cool because you just, you have your entire makeup in one pack and you just put it in your purse and it's perfection. So that's that for blush. Next up, we have a liquid bronzer by Sai, which, oh my God, this formula is amazing. Like a serum bronzer, this on its own, with no makeup on and just like brown mascara, is so stunning. It feels, it feels like you're putting skincare on, which is, I don't know, my goals these days. Like, I don't want to feel like I'm wearing makeup. I have a variety of shade as well, which I do appreciate, but I don't know how they did this formula, but it's just, ugh, oh, it's so good. Anyway. If you want to try it, I, I at least suggest it because it's so good. And um, especially if you're like a natural makeup girly, you'll truly appreciate it. Or if you're into like skincare makeup type of uh, formulas, you'll do like it as well. 
but I wore that nonstop during summertime and oh, it's so good, so good. So um, the next product is gonna be a primer. This one, I discovered it at the end of summer. I had it first, I had it for so long, but I never actually tried it. And once I tried it, that's the only primer that I'm using now. So it is the NYX Professional Makeup Freezy Face Cooling Primer plus moisturizer. So it's actually a cream and a base. Um, I thought it was more for like pore minimizing and I don't know, the texture really reminds me of that, but it's actually like a gel, like a sticky gel mixed with a hydrating water cream. It's super refreshing as well. So during the summertime, I do appreciate this formula. Okay, so my appointment is online instead of in person. Okay, so I'm gonna go with the next product because I don't remember where I was at. But the next product um, is actually those lip liners. Um, I've been, I was obsessed all summer with these. I just like the packaging that it's like twisted. Um, the, it's super creamy, they're really pigmented. To quickly mention, um, pairing these lip liners with the YSL uh, Love Shine Lipstick because, oh, they're just so good. I was wearing the shade 204 all summer. I think I even did it real on this lip combo and I actually grabbed this shade in Bellflower. My favorite shade was the Nudist with the uh, YSL 205 in the love shine oh that was my favorite lip combo all summer and now we switch to fall so now i'm only wearing this because ah oh, this shade is so good and it smells like chocolate anyway so the next product is the l'oreal voluminous mascara nothing special about this mascara i just love it so much it's an oldie but a goodie but this summer, I've been enjoying wearing it in brown, dark brown. I don't know why, it just gives me more of a like natural neutral vibe. And I've just been loving brown mascaras lately, like dark brown mascaras. And when I did my lash lift, I actually did also a brown, um, dark brown tinted tint. So I don't know why, I just feel like it's super natural, but it's giving like real lashes instead of like I put mascara on, which you know, you still see it that it's mascara, but you know what I mean. So I don't know why, I've just been loving the brown mascara. And for the fall with the collection that I just created, brown mascaras is so pretty, so pretty. It's so good. So if you haven't tried brown mascara, I at least suggested Take a shot every time I say brown mascaras. But if you haven't tried brown mascaras, especially for fall, I highly suggest it because it just gives the perfect, the perfect fall vibes. Which one to do first? I think I'm gonna do this one and keep the best for last. So um, the next thing is probably, I think you saw me use this in every freaking video and every day of my life. This is the All Nighter, uh, the Urban Decay All Nighter Ultra Glow. I feel like for the summertime, you always need an extra glow. So, um, I also got uh, NPR. I need to film a video for them, actually, because I loved it too much. The hyaluronic acid, like the watermelon one. And now I'm just obsessed and I really want to try them all. So, so anyway, their setting sprays are just the best. They're so good. And the Ultra Glow this summer, I've been enjoying more than the others just because it's super like extra glowy but i have a video coming up on um all the different urban decay setting spray and how they work and um like the difference between all of them because i think they have five so i'm really hyped but these setting sprays are just the best so if you haven't tried these just do it the formula is amazing it makes your makeup last all day and it gives an ultra glow but there's also one that is extra matte so if you're more dewy and you want to be matte just take the the extra matte or the matte version. And then lastly, the best thing that I discovered this summer is the Luxo Neuro Cosmetic Lip Peptide Treatment. Oh my God. Like, you know how obsessed I was with the Summer Friday one. I've been using it for the past three years. I was like obsessed. And in my head, nothing was better than the Summer Friday Lip Balm. This is. This is the Summer Friday Lip Balm, but lighter. Like it's like you have to get your hands on the transparent shade. 
because oh, it's just the lip balm is just so good. I don't know what to say. It's just the best thing ever. Like I keep applying it and replaying it and it's just the best lip balm ever. So if you want to try something out of her line and highly recommend trying the lip peptide. And again, if you use Fabula 15, you get 15% off on everything. And yeah, that's probably my favorite thing out of everything created. Anyway, I'm going to stop talking. I hope you guys have a great day. I actually have to run because I have an appointment in like 40 minutes. So I hope you guys love this um, type of content. If you do, leave a comment and tell me if you want me to do a same, the same type of video for fall. And I promise maybe next time my nails won't be broken. Um, so anyway, I hope you guys love this video. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.